light has been around for many millions of years. And in fact, it has created us, it has created life, has created all the stuff of life. So it's inherently safe to use. It wouldn't be great to use that for wireless communications. We transmit with our technology not only a single data stream, we transmit thousands of data streams in parallel at even higher speeds. So what happens when I switch on that light? As you would expect, it's a light, a desk lamp. You could put your book beneath and can, could read. It's illuminating the, the space. But at the same time, you see this video coming up here. And this is a video, high definition video, uh, that is transmitted through that light beam. You're all critical. You say, ha ha ha, this is a smart academic doing a little bit of tricks here. But let me do this. <laughs> Once again, still don't believe? <laughs> it is this light that transmits this high definition video, this split stream. And if you look at the light, it is illuminating as you would expect. You don't notice with your human eye. LiFi has also been successfully tested in a commercial context. There's been trials and offices in Estonia that are reporting transmission speeds of one gigabit per second still a hundred times faster than current average Wi-Fi speeds. So imagine this, you could walk into any room, switch on the light and simultaneously instantly have an internet connection a hundred times faster than your regular Wi-Fi. But it doesn't stop there. Researchers at the Oxford University have published results of visible light internet at 223 gigabits per second. With those speeds, you could download 18 1.5 gigabyte movies in one second.